Mario vs. Knight here once again, so once again on me. And today I got another quick little unboxing for a quick little review for you fools, eh? Today I got the Homie Galactus Whistle for Surfer Way, which is actually a 10 inch pop. And there's actually, I don't know how many inches freaking Super Surfer is. He's like around like, probably like two inches, way. Which, uh, yeah, man, I actually picked this baby up from my local uh, moving trading goods uh, company store, which I picked it up for $49.99. And if you guys are interested in buying um, this pop, eh, you can find it anywhere online, man. Like Big uh, big Bad Toy Store, GameStop has it. I don't know if it's still available there for pre order, but I'm pretty sure it is eh, an Amazon or any retailer usually that carries pops, eh, they're gonna have these PA exclusives, eh? These PA exclusives, eh, everybody carries them. Even Hot Topic carries them now. And uh, go check your local comic book shop too, eh? Because they're usually the ones that carry these mostly all the time, eh? These PA exclusive ones. But uh, yeah, man, this uh, freaking Galactus with Silver Surfer, what, what can I say, man? This is one of the pops that I've been waiting for Funko to do. And you know what? They finally, you know, they delivered, way. Eh? And I'm really excited that they, you know, they actually did something creative, way, eh? you know? So, uh, yeah, man, without further ado, man, let me, let's scope out the box, which the box is art, whatever, it's pretty much the same as the newest uh, uh, Fantastic Four Pops, eh? The same writing here, and just the difference is that it's Galactic Silver Surfer, which is actually the same, um, Galactus design as the regular four inch way. The only difference is that he actually has his hand out where Silver Surfer's gonna stand or whatever. But yeah, man, the side, you see the side of the box, and on the back, that's all the pops you could get, the whole wave, boom, and that's the regular Galactus, regular four inch. Let me see, focus, focus. There you go. And the Surfer Surfer. But uh, popping this baby open, eh? Taking a little closer look, way. Which, by the way, if you guys don't know, um, freaking uh, Galactus' first appearance, way, his first appearance was in uh, Fantastic Four issue 49 and uh, 1966, way back in the day. And then Silver Surfer's first appearance was in obviously Fantastic Four issue 48, way, again in 1960, way. But, um, yeah, man, Galactus is a dope, dope character, man. I can't wait to see that fool and freaking, um, an MCU man, I I, I want to see him, but oh, look at this beauty. That's right, eh? Oh, this was heavy. The only thing I hate is that why does Marvel? I know it's a licensing thing with the freaking bobblehead, but I would have wished that they could have done this for non bobblehead, eh? It just gets annoying. But damn, look at this beauty, man. And he does have that metallic look to him. Well, kind of. Not really, but it does. Because they did say he was going to be metallic, eh? It does kind of look kind of metallic, but not like super, super metallic, eh? But a dope, dope pop, man. Look at him. Has his hand out. Which, one thing I am seeing is that I thought it was going to have like a little peg here. On, um, well, like a little peg right here on Silver Surfer's board or whatever where you could you know stick them in there which is not gonna have it doesn't even have a peg or anything he's just gonna just sit there like this which the only issue i have with that is he has a bobblehead who's gonna tip him over fool if you move him you see i thought it was gonna have like a little hole here and silver silver was gonna have like a little peg which i don't know why they did that man they should have gave this for a little peg so you could you know Hook him on there so he won't freaking fall. Come on, Funko. We should have not made this full freaking bobblehead. But yeah, man, there's Galactus right here. I'll put him in the little, uh, my little spinner right now. So he give you like a 360 look at him. A nice little paint job on him. That purple, that blue. Looks super dope. See his hand out. Okay, big old head, mate. And then uh, taking a little closer look at freaking um, mini little Silver Surfer. Which this is actually the same size as the little Pocket Pop Pops, hey. Which if I had my Pocket Pop near me, I would have compared it, hey. But it's pretty much the same size as that. Which this one also has the same pose. That yeah, he has the same pose as the newer Silver Surfer, same mold. 
but nice. I like how they gave them the little clear little stand. Better look at Galactus holding Silver Surfer, which I gotta admit, it looks super dope, man. Look at that vato. Sick. Hey, I feel about to let that fool loose, homie. He's gonna tell that fool, hey, fool, go find me a planet, way, Because I'm feeling hungry, wait. That's right. Pinche Galactus, wait. That pasas de verga, wait. But, uh, yeah, man, let me give you guys a little quick little 360 spin, way, So you can scope them out, eh, from all different angles, eh. So yeah, man, overall, man, is this pop worth uh, the 45, 50 bucks, eh? Well, you know what? That, that, that's all up to you, eh? But in my opinion, eh, I think it is because I love the concept, man. I love how Funko got creative, eh? You know, putting Galactus and Silver Server together, which it makes super sense, eh? But the only thing I do... I do this like man is that Funko for 50 bucks way come on Funko why are you getting lazy on this you could have put a little peg here so you could you know freaking Galactus could stay stationed you know I mean Silver Super could stay stationed he won't have any issues of him tipping over or whatever man like I get it some people probably want Silver Super off his hand but why way this whole point of this pop is having Silver Super in his hand way come on way but uh yeah man besides that man besides that little issue I, I love it I love this whole concept man I'm hoping Funko continues doing these in the future like with the Sentinel and like little X-Men characters getting down with them or something or one X-Men character but yeah man uh, for 45-50 bucks man you know I think it's worth it man it's nice scope nice paint job everything it looks kind of exactly the same as the 4 inch it's just um this was right hand it's kind of sideways like this and the 4 inch one he's like going forward but overall, man, dope pop, man. And uh, let me know if you guys are copying this pop or you guys skipping it or did you guys pre-order already or what's your thoughts on it, man. And uh, yeah, man, once again, if you guys are new to the channel, you like Funko Pops unboxings, uh, Funko Hunts and Mystery Box unboxings, homie, and a little bit of comic books, wait, then you're in the right spot, wait, and a straight 89 out play, yeah.